Hello champions, how are you guys doing? Uh, okay, my mic is good. <laughs> I, ha I muted my mic earlier. Um, I'm going to start a new game. This is actually going to be my first, first playthrough on this channel for some reason. I don't know why. Well, technically speaking. Uh, but yeah, so I'm going to play some Biomune. I bought it and don't even know what it is. Also, it might be loud, just warning you about that. So, yeah. It is loud. Oh my god. Hold on. <laughs> I'm muting it. I'm muting it. Hold on. <laughs> it is loud to me. Hold on. This is also the first time that I'm booting it up, so... Nice. Ah, oh, I've been wanting to play this. But I'm just like... Very small percentage of individuals may experience epileptic seizures when exposed to certain light patterns or flashing lights. Exposure to certain patterns or backgrounds, the computer screen, or while playing video games may induce an epileptic seizure in these individuals. Certain conditions may induce a... Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, yeah. I, I don't know what to do with that, so... Uh, has an autosave. Nice. Okay. So yeah, I've been wanting to play this. I've been debating if I wanted to do Let's Play videos or if I wanted to just stream it. So now it's just going to be a stream because uh, it seems like that would be best. You can't really see it, but my cat's all the way back there. Well, you can kind of see it. She's she's a little bit over there. I, I put up a toy and she's just licking the feathers for some reason. Misty! Hey! Uh-oh, hold on. Hold on. This is bad. <laughs> hey! Stop it! You're like destroying the feathers on this. Do I need I'm gonna put this up. Sorry, no. First. There you go. Okay. There you go. Here, have this. Okay. We're back. <laughs> Oh, but yeah, I wanted to I wanted to stream this. Hopefully it's not too loud. Uh, I will turn myself down just a little bit. Hopefully this is good. Uh, but yeah, so I wanted to stream this now. Uh, I had this in my library for a while, so... Uh, we'll do about, say, 94. We'll do 94. My quick question, though, is... <gasps> Use the controller. I'm happy. <laughs> Hold on. There we go. Yeah, this is gonna be new to me. So, grasshopper. Ooh. Okay. Whoa. Okay. It's definitely going to be loud. <laughs> uh oh. Ah, <laughs> that is cool. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, that is a mine. Uh oh, no. Uh, start running. That actually. Okay, that's not good. <laughs> Fuck, okay. Uh, we're English. We're English. Oh! How can something as beautiful as this be dying? Uh huh. A plague is ruining the land, but the tree of life still stands. Question is, for how long? End is coming to the new world. The tribes stand divided, in need of someone strong enough to unite them, or bring them all down. This is a story with an unusual beginning. So, let's expect an unusual end. 
<laughs> okay. To bio mutant. Okay. Uh, so yeah, that was the first time I logged in. That was actually a fucking cool thing. I like that. Okay. Uh, yeah, you can definitely... Hold on. Yeah, you'll definitely hear <laughs> my clicks. I'm sorry. Uh, audio is what I wanted. Turn it to 90 for master. Or... Er, That should be good, right? Yeah, that should be good. Turn to 83. Uh, I don't think there's anything else that I really need to do. At least not right now, because I don't know what the things are, so... Yep. Okay, new game. Ooh. What extreme mode? We're going extreme. <laughs> Who cares? We're going extreme. <laughs> Grasshopper, nice. Grasshopper from the beginning, right? Oh, it's the same cutscene, isn't it? Okay. Encode your DNA. <laughs> okay. Huh. First primal. Primal is a. N okay, just making sure. Primal is a nimble, developed anthropomorphic breed a hybrid with a gene mutation making them nimble and dexterous at the cost of a lesser developed intelligence dum 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 is the least developed anthropomorphic breed a hybrid offshoot that compensates the lack of mental prowess with physical strength rex rex is an external developed anthropomorphic breed a hybrid outcast with an even dna string making it adept for both physical and mental challenges Ooh, that's actually pretty good Hila is a regenerative, developed, anthropomorphic breed, a hybrid with a gene mutation making them extremely tough and resilient. Hi. Fit. The Fit breed is renowned for a highly evolved mind. Its genius is developed interlinked to the power of key, which amplifies their psychonic output. And Murgle is the definition of idealized breed. Its evolutionary lineage has gone in a direction where form and appearance has dominated over function. Form and appearance has dominated. Oh. That's all bad, though. Uh, I'm kind of thinking between Primal, which has less key energy, less melee damage, but more luck, I guess. I'm actually thinking I'm going with Rex. Rex seems like a good option. I'm going to go with Rex. Also, Rex is cute. Attributes. Define your character's starting attributes. To see more detailed explanation of what effect each... Okay. Define your genetic structure. <laughs> okay. So that's even. What's agility? Agility is more height. Okay. More rabbit. Got it. Charisma. <laughs> So like this just a bigger head. I love that. Oh, no neck. I kind of want a neck. So I think... Wait. Vitality is health and armor. Meanwhile, agility is more move speed. Kind of want more vitality and strength. Yeah, I think that should be good. Don't know what the bottom five things are, though. Uh, okay. Choose a genetic resilience. Oh, that's what that is. Heat, biohazard, cold, radioactivity. Ooh, what's the difference between these two? Oh, it changes my arm, too. That's pretty cool. I'm going to have to go with heat and either biohazard or radioactivity. Which one looks cooler? I think that one looks cooler. <laughs> I'm just going based off of looks. Choose your first style. <gasps> oh. Bless you. You good? She's doing the snake posture where she looks like this. That's just her sneezing. You okay? Sneeze all the way out. 
or cough. No, it's a cough. It's cough. It's cough. It's cough. We're good. It's cough. Hmm. I kind of want to go with the raccoon type of look. Pick your main color. Don't tell me. I can go green. <laughs> nah, I like red. I kind of like a little bit of red, to be honest. I, I'm I'm definitely a red type of. Choose your detail color. Cool. Go a little bit with the blue. Or nice, like. Pick a class. Oh God, there's so many. <laughs> So many starting points. We're not even in the game and it's already like 10 minutes in. Okay, Dead Eyes, a tricky skill for Rouge. Rouge? Rogue. Rogue? I don't know. Rogue. Rogue who's chosen a life outside the law and so society values. Perfect reload. Your ranged weapons are reloaded instantly and your next bank is in this guarantee. Ooh. Commander. Wait a minute. I kind of want the Dead Eye because I get a sword. And also, I'm more. If I'm gonna be honest, I'm more of a sword and a small like pistol type of person. So. Command sight, sab, sight. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. Sab Sentinel. Sent <laughs> Saboteur. Command. Okay, hold on. Commando. Uh, Commando is trained as an operative of an elite special operations force. Commandos are used in working in smaller teams. Ranged weapon attacks inflict 10% more damage to the target. Mega mind. <laughs> Experimenting with psych psychonic powers and mutations, they usually outcast on the fringe of society. Spark ball. Spark ball. To shoot a spark ball, press down the input you have bound the ability to. Make you throw the ball in the direction you are facing, inflicting damage to the enemy you hit. Key energy regen is increased. Saboteur. Saboteur is a cunning, skilled explorer trained to op operate covertly in both suburban, suburb and wilderness. Melee dual wield skill. Ooh, equip two different one-handed melee weapons. E, But their size looks pretty cool. Sentinel. Sentinel. Your base armor is increased by 10. Command. Nah, I like Deadeye. I like Deadeye. You get a pistol and a, a sword. Dead eye chosen. I like this. Oh, she's back. Hold on. Who at the door? to your bed. There you go. <sighs> uh, hold on. I actually want to test something. I didn't realize that you could just hear that. That is going to be a very high thing. Anyways, uh, I'm going to turn this up a little bit because I don't know if you guys can hear this. There we go. I think that should be good, right? Anyways. Yeah, let's confirm. That'll work. It will. <laughs> okay. Here's somebody with a troubled past, drawn into the spotlight of a story that's already begun. Ooh. Uh, before anything happens, hold on. Okay. Go back to audio. I can turn this all the way up. It doesn't matter. It'll only matter when it gets really, really loud, so. We'll go with negative nine and go with zero for me. How's that? Uh... Okay, negative 10. There, okay. That should work. Ooh. Yeah, bunny hop. We're already oh. at the crossroads. Choosing a path <laughs> in life is that fork in the road where you make a choice or simply stop living. Okay. But for you, it's not only a crossroad. 
but a choice. A reflection of your key, the primal energy that flows Ooh. through everything. Dark as in strength and power. Color me light for freedom and loyalty. I'm more... Let me introduce myself. I'm the light and bright side of you. Or your inner voice, to be precise. An echo of balance and consequence of your actions as you move forward. You are so adorable. Oh my god. I hope you're just like, you're here with me. Hold on. I'm not sure light for me. Light is only for those who oh my god. seeing what's in front of them. Sticking to the me first path is the only way we'll be going places. Uh, I'm surprised at the change of heart. I believe in putting yourself aside. You can't fight. You're trying to keep us in the dark Sorry. here. Sorry, I completely forgot. It's blue blood in our veins and what it means. We have responsibilities. You can't fight the truth. Mm-hmm. No. We're going with light. <laughs> right is always right. <laughs> right is always right. Yep, it is. We're going we're going with light. I just wanted to see what the other one was. That was pretty cute. Oh, this is dangerous, isn't it? At least we got one light. Of death and the body is left behind. Oh. A reminder that we're at the mercy of nature and the one that preys on others. Uh huh. Wait a minute. It's is it is it dropping frames? I think we're good. We're good. Okay. Examine the gnat. <laughs> Do you remember the beast that shattered your family, or did you choose to forget? You turned your back on our world uh -huh. and got lost in your own. Ooh. Meanwhile, the predator only grew stronger. Okay. It has some meaning. Oh. Uh oh. Ooh. Oh, fuck. Okay. Come on. Oh. Okay. Ah, oh, I gotta really get better at dodging. Okay. Come on. Okay, that was horrible. Hold on. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, how am I? Wait. <laughs> okay. It's the crashing scene. Oh, no, it's the detonator. Okay. This is not the time nor place to end this story. Ow. Roll, roll, roll. <laughs> there we go. Okay. What are you doing? Uh, I forget every control. <laughs> it was best to run and live to fight another day. Let us hope you're ready for it when it comes. Uh-oh. Okay. <laughs> We're good. I don't think we're good. The predator isn't the oh. only threat. The wildlife started to mutate when the end of days began, <laughs> and the tree of life started to die. Okay. Move towards an enemy to target them with melee. Aim the camera towards an enemy to target them with ranged. To reload. Okay. That's going to be important. When the ammo indicator is red, you can perform a quick reload. Successful, successful quick reload. We'll show the reload time and increase the damage on the next bullet. Key energy is used for dodging, using mutations, and performing special attacks. When you're out of key, 
energy, you'll be, you'll be unable to perform these actions. Your key energy re regenerates both in and out of combat. Come here. Woo. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Okay, I get it now. they give us a gun, am I right? Ooh, okay. And then... There. <laughs> I am hurt, though. That's what expert mode will do. <laughs> Okay, In interact. Uh, hold on, hold on. There we go. Okay. I hear you. Interact. And a weapon special effect add-on. Attach it to your ranged weapon to give it an extra damage type for as long as the ammo lasts. Some of these have a resistance or weakness to different weapon special effects, so use them wisely. Okay. Uh, I am going to just pick up to attach the... Oh! Special effects add-on. Open the menu and hold. Okay. What about this? <laughs> pew pew! <laughs> and Zong Big Blade got it. Okay. That's pretty cool. Medical bag. I will take that. Found a medic supply. Bags like this contain items that can help heal you. Your health doesn't automatically regenerate in combat. You have to use consumables or other ways. Oh, okay. So it's, it does it out of battle. Got it. Health packet. Pick up. Yep. Hold on. She is back. I'm just gonna do this, why not? Uh, chatting. What do you want? What do you want? What up? Here you go. You're better now. Ah, back. <laughs> there we go. We're good. We should be good. There we go. I had to click on it to activate the music. Oh, what's around here? A bathroom. Don't tell me. Lousy. What's this for? I mean, I'll pick it, but okay. Okay. I guess it's just a mod. Got it. I've already learned how to run. those arms nice okay uh oh remember to parry enemy attacks when the enemy attacks you can see lightning bolts flashing above their head yep the oil sludges everywhere for most it only means death but some have adapted to the new environment and changed with it. Evolution oh, what? Sludge Soaker? Who? Oh. Oh. 
Whoop. Ah, okay. Gotta do this Dark Souls style. Whoo! Oh. <laughs> come on. Ow. Okay, never mind. I don't want it. I don't want you to come on. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> okay. Just spam the gun, we're good. <laughs> Fallen enemies can often be looted for healing items. Find a high highlighted fallen enemy. Okay. Yep. Dandy candy. Common. Okay. Nice. Nice. I uh, don't want to go through there. Wait. Oh, you do follow me. I'm like, where's my, where's my grasshopper buddy? Okay. We're good. We're good. <laughs> Defeat the Rockaboom. Ooh. Oh, fuck. Let me re reload. I'm still technically in combat, so uh, this one. You just. There we go. Okay. There we go. There we go. Get caught in a combo. Ooh. Uh-oh. Hi. Stay away from me, please. Thank you. Ooh. <laughs> okay, that was actually I I do have to admit that was actually really cool for me. Danity, okay. Oh, I'm loving this game already. I was I was thinking of Oh, don't tell me. Okay, never mind. I was thinking of doing the video, and then I'm just like, I'm never gonna play it if I don't do the video. So. Let's open this. Someone gonna come out? Explore the tunnel, okay. Uh, just making sure that there's nothing else around here that I can loot. Actually. It might be a little bit too bright. Where is it? Audio? No, video. Oh, I can't change that now, can I? <laughs> there it is. Eh, that's a little bit better. Yeah, that's better. Hopefully it's not bugging out too much. Oh. Some of these enemies carry large shields. You need to break the shield when melee attacks before you can deal damage. Oh. Come on. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Nice. Got it. Oh, there's more. Oh, they can block too. Oh, 
<laughs> Being enemies and completing quests will give you XP. Leveling up allows you to raise one of your attributes by 10. You'll also get one point that you can use to unlock skills in the <laughs> first menu. Uh, is it this? No, this is map. Level up. Let's see. When you level up your character... You can increase an attribute of your choice by 10. Okay, uh... We'll go with agility. Learn upgrade points when leveling up. These can be used to acquire new special attacks and perks. Time to unlock your first special attack. Select close combat or range combat. We're gonna go with close combat. Ranged guns. <laughs> no, we're going to go with a two-handed slash. Oh, I can upgrade one of these. Okay. Um, XXY. Yep. You now perform your special attack when you have the correct weapon type equipped. Okay. So XXY got it. Uh, I saw this glowing up too. I never read what that was either. So. Let's see. Dude, that one I can't interact with. Examine what's oh, through here. An emergency box from the once was a rare sight. Do I get a crossbow? Or a crowbar? <laughs> Clawbar. Oh, I have to use it on the door, okay. Hopefully the music isn't too loud. I'm able to like adjust it so I can't really tell. Uh, exit the room. That pipe looks weak. The claw bar should come in handy. There we go. Nice. Let's enter. <laughs> A way out of this place. No, really, I mean it. Hmm. I feel like when I exit, I'm gonna come into that dude from the very beginning. Okay. The Morks produce bio matter in their multi organ that they share under the stress. Globs that affect oh. the cellular coding strands of any living being when absorbed, including you. You're on your way to performing a special attack. Possible special attacks are prompted in the lower right hand corner of the screen. Pressing the mitigate input will, while it is shown, will trigger your special attack. Okay. Ooh! <laughs> nice. Ooh. Oh, so I can counter that. Okay, nice. You absorbed a bio blob. These are points used to unlock mutations. You unlock bio blobs by defeating morks and finding containers at various places in the world. Use bio blobs to unlock special powers at any time. Backs. Okay. The scrap keeps piling up. Hmm. Through here? Yeah, okay. Low tech, but it works. Ooh. This is starting to get intriguing to me now. I mean, it already was, but this is starting to get more intricate and stuff like that, so I'm liking this a lot more. Sad I didn't play this earlier. <laughs> hey, Geta. This looks neat. Yes, it does. I don't. Uh, I, I love it already. Toxinol built vessels hmm. called arcs to save themselves from the impending doom. But 
was it too late? It is only from the flight logs of the single Ark they left behind that we know other Arks traveled through the sky and beyond. It seems those that came before us never lost hope in finding a new home for their kind. I'm very intrigued now. <laughs> hmm. Found a puzzle, these are scattered around the world, some open new paths, while others feature different rewards. Switch which node to use selected, use that. This is the number of rotations you have left, the higher intellect, the more moves you have. Each node has a certain position it must be rotated into to complete the puzzle, We're running out of moves before that may cause consequences. Just a few moves left. Make them count. Yep. What was it? There. <laughs> what is this going to bring us to? There are few records of the chain of events that led to the big apocalypse eons ago, but it's clear the world wasn't prepared for how recklessly the Toxinol Corporation would make its mark on the world. Their mm. rare earth mining and nuclear industries generated tons of waste and, without consideration for the future, they dumped it all in landfills until they ran out of space. That's when they made the big mistake. They began dumping the toxic waste in the surf just off the coast instead, assuming that it would sink and decay with time. And they were right. But no one was prepared for what was about to unfold. Once in the surf, the radiation interfered with the genetics of the wildlife and created bizarre mutations in their offspring. It had an inconceivable impact on biodiversity and the entire ecosystem. The world as they knew it crumbled as nature retaliated. It would never be the same again, and what remained of it became ours. Okay, that just unlocked a little bit of story. So basically, Apocalypse <laughs> is what I'm getting at. The sound of spark metal going mm. pew pew is never a good thing. It's coming from behind that door. A warning label. The box looks like a potential brain melt. It's going oh. to take a bit of puzzling to short circuit the door. Okay, so this here. <laughs> okay. Perfect. There you go. Oh, I okay. I thought it was just going to like electrocute someone who was hitting it, but okay. There's someone there. Uh, hmm. Perfectly countering an enemy attack will stun them. A stunned enemy has started circling above their head, and after hitting the enemy again, you can launch it up in the air by pressing. The wheeled one is outnumbered. You'd better help him out. Oh, okay, we're helping him out, okay. Nice. I'm just gonna deflect everything <laughs> at this point. Ooh! Okay, so I'm understanding combat a little bit more. Which is getting a lot easier. 
Oh, he's already dead. Okay. They're just getting thrown everywhere. <laughs> well, I want to collect everything first. Nice. For here, you gotta always collect stuff. Check later. First C. There you go. Might not need that now, but you will later. Yep. That's what I was thinking. Oh, a new friend and old friend. How are you doing, Geta, by the way? I'm sorry. I, just, I, got, I got very, like, sucked up into the game because I've been wanting to play this. I'm sorry. How are you, how's your day going? How's your week been? He wants to thank you for taking his side against the scavengers. He sounds familiar. You just can't figure out why. Hmm. He presents himself as out of date. He knows he's way overdue, but he hasn't given up. He doesn't seem surprised that you don't recognize him. You were just a child back then. Playing Minecraft? Nice. The night everything changed. <laughs> there have been rumors of a one-eyed ronin mm. seen outside the Great Wall, and he's happy to see it's true. The legend of the one-eyed child that grew up as an outcast is old and sad. The child could have been anyone, but the evil it had fled had left a mark, a facial scar to remember the past. There's no doubt you're the child, and that what Lupa Lupin did to your village, your Mooma and Popsy, was the beginning of the end. Mooma and Popsy. He says it has taken you a long time to bring the past back up to the present to find your way back, but he's grateful you have. It was after the attack that the mm. unity fell apart. Your Mooma's disciples divided and formed tribes as a reaction to the blight that had fallen upon the land. Had it not been for the Tree of Life, no one would have survived. He hopes you at least remember the tree. Okay, now since it's paused. <laughs> okay, well, don't worry about anything about this game now. <laughs> I, I just, I saw one day, I'm like, that, yeah, it does look cool, so I just bought it. Ah, oh, Mooma and Popsy, though. Ah, oh, dang, Mooma, come on. <laughs> I'm actually going to do something really quickly, so give me a minute. I'm going to... where is it? Hmm. Oh, Minecraft is going well, by the way. Just going to... there. That should work. Yeah, I hope Minecraft's going well. You're in your uh, two-week Minecraft period, I guess. <laughs> My default dialogues are set to advance from one NPC line to the next automatically. Having trouble loading it, actually. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Is it, like... Is it modded? Is that what you're trying to play? I want to manually advance. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, I hope it loads soon. <laughs> it's super mod. <laughs> okay, well then. I mean that. Yeah. Nice. Ah, <sighs> I hope it. I'm gonna try starting over the load. Okay. Yeah, that that might uh that might work. Hmm. Well, I hope it. I hope it loads, and I hope uh, you have your a good modded adventure, because <laughs> modded Minecraft is always good. Okay, what the heck is this? <laughs> so small.
I like this. Oh, I just now realized. Okay. Do I play Minecraft? Yeah, I do. I think I, <laughs> I just, I just got done with my my Minecraft period, so. <laughs> Asks if you were tired, as it's a bit of a hike here from the village. He wonders if your Mooma knows you are here. Ooh, okay. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> this is what got me happy. <laughs> so I think that's uh the dude who we were just talking to. <laughs> that one has people from Boots Community. Okay. Oh, then it must be like very active then. <laughs> that's good. Yes, if you're tired. Uh, I hope I told her. I don't think she cares. I hope I told her. You're such a good child, so you probably did. Even the young forget. Oh, okay. Nice. He understands why you came all the way out here to see them, the potato people. <laughs> the potato people, or Mono. <laughs> Are a wonder somehow interlinked with this little tree here fueling its source of life. I am too. <laughs> I mean, it's it's a pretty good Elvis impression, to be honest. Uh, get the diamonds on that server. I don't believe in magic. No, no. Potato people are better. Potato people. You might be right. Like potatoes, they're packed with energy, an excellent source of key. <laughs> the Nono prefer to hide in glitter grass. Ooh. He says you should get over there and ruffle it. See if you can make one come out of hiding. Get diamonds or something better than diamonds. <laughs> First day. Even the voice, even the... the uh... The talking sounded a little bit like it, which was pretty good. <laughs> ruffle it? How do I ruffle? Just like... Oh! You found one! You should be proud. They don't come out for everyone. The small tree you saw up there where you met will eventually grow into a tree of life and start giving back to nature. It'll be the heart of the land. Okay. You need to support the tree for a long time to come. The only way it'll grow tall is with the burst of key released from the nono as they become one with the tree. You'll need a net to catch the nono, and he wants you to use his, but asks you to be gentle. The nono are sensitive beings, an embodiment of key, the primal energy. I'm not expecting this, boys. <laughs> I got a hoop net. <laughs> Come here. There. You handle that net like you've never done anything else. He's impressed. <laughs> One day, he hopes the tree will have grown tall enough to sustain the world. Oh my god. But today, your focus is getting this one to become one with the tree. Okay. You got it. Why are you so much taller than me? <laughs> Murder to the Nano with the tree. You got it. Is that the I I'm not even listening. The fucking voice got me. Is that the potato people? <laughs> oh, the seeds. Now that you've seen the Nono's connection with the tree with your own eyes, you have no reason to doubt. I wasn't doubting, but okay. <laughs> From this day on, he'll make nurturing the Pensai into a tree of life, a life goal. Not only for our village's sake, but for all of us, everyone. <laughs> 
Pensai. One day, the land won't be as peaceful. Not even your Mooma will be able to protect us. He says you better hurry back to the village before your Mooma comes looking for you. You did good here today. We shouldn't make her worry. I was starting to understand it a little bit, the, the lore and all that. You know, dumping and then all, all the mutations and stuff like that. And now... You bring in Elvis... What is this? Like... Elvis Mole. And potatoes and trees. And now I'm... So confused. <laughs> no, she's got lots on her mind and needs rest after the raid last night on the Lupin camp with her disciples. Wonders if they let the Predator family live or not. Maybe. Who knows? He lost you there for a while, but no memory is alone. It's part of a trail you can follow. He says he remembers every single day he devoted to growing the Tree of Life, but now he's afraid it might be in vain. The tree started to die when the end of days begun, and it wasn't long after that that the World Eaters arrived. Ah, uh, World Eaters. I'm actually intrigued oh, now. Oh, yeah. The genetic evolution that occurred after the apocalypse, the Toxinol Corporation inflicted on the land, set the World Eaters' DNA into overdrive. Oh? His friend Gizmo is working on a Mekton and needs help defeating the Jumbo Puff at the end of the West Route. Jumbo Puff. Wiz is still repairing his Octopod to confront the Merc Puff that dwells deep down under the surface at the end of the Northwest Route. Okay. Noko has tamed the Majut and is preparing to take on the Hoof Puff at the end of the East Route. This, uh, Finally, so... Goop is almost done with the Goo Glide, a machine able to ride the waves of the surf all the way out to the Porky Puff at the end of the route to the southeast. <laughs> out of date, says his friends are gearing up to stop the World Eaters. There's one at the end of each route. No, Maui, okay. The road ahead won't be easy, but he's counting on your support. His friends aren't strong enough to end this on their own. Okay. He wants you to understand that you'll all die if the tree isn't saved. Regardless, you'll meet again once you've played your part in the tribe war and the situation with the world eaters. Okay. Hey. We got a net. We got a net. So, you have. I love the names. I love the names in this already. Culpy Dunes, Mushy Mosh, Miri. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing these correctly. Naki Leaves, <laughs> Yerp Fields. Knup Stonies. Surfapelago. That one's actually pretty good. And then the Dead Zone and Whereabouts. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, You're getting the hang of it. Yep. Who's here? Quickest oh. way out is through the roof where they came in. And the rope looks strong enough to climb. Wait, how is out of date gonna get through here now? I mean, could climb. Never mind. Hmm. Okay. I feel like I'm gonna hold on. I'm gonna just go back to settings and change the video one more time. The brightness. 
Is that good? Oh, that is so much better. <laughs> that is so much better. I don't know why I had it on so bright, but this is so much better. I usually have it on bright so I can see everything, but... Know that the tree of life is dying. Its days are numbered. Without help, it can't endure the environmental change and assault from the world eaters. Okay. Ah, oh, it's already looking good. I love this. I'm already loving this. <laughs> world eaters, tree of life, potato people. Let's do this. Hey, I got an achievement. The adventure begins. Ah, <sighs> where to next? A signpost maps it out for the cartographically challenged. Let's see. I know I did not just do that. Signposts are found near locations of interest all around the world. You lock a signpost when interacting with it. You can fast travel to a signpost you've unlocked. Oh, you know what? That makes sense. That makes sense. We'll pee on. We'll pee on. Uh, on signs. That's what we'll do. We'll pee on signs. We will pee on them. Sent them. Oh, fuck, never mind. What the fuck is that? Hi! Are you a world eater? That must be the world eater that chewed off out of date's leg. You'll need a hat trick to bring that down. Definitely. So that is a world eater. Okay. Same in the village. Look, a survivor. Glad to see someone made it out alive. Hi. He's a surfer. He's heard the stories about the terror inflicted by the world eaters to other enclaves, but never expected one to come all the way here. Your inner balance is two halves that complete a wholeness that flows through all things. At times, you'll be able to manifest your inner balance through deeds and dialogue choices. Few are those who always act in the same manner, and our our whole. Wholeness is the sum of the choices we make and the actions we make. Balance of your actions creates your aura score, which affects the dialogue with other characters. Hold on. The cat meowed. I heard it. She wants to come in. Where are you? Come on. There you go. Gotcha. <sighs> okay, so we need to balance our, I think, dark and light, right? He worries there won't be much left to save if this continues, even if the Tree of Life survives the attack. He doesn't know what your connection is to this place, but something tells him you've stayed true to your heart. I have. Interacting with captives and PSI shrines will award you with PSI points that you can use to unlock psychonic powers. Powers can only be unlocked once you have reached the required dark or light inner balance. Anyway, he needs help and says it's by your actions you'll be judged, not by your intentions. Well, you see, I'm mostly a pacifist and I try to help people, so let, well, let me help. He's grateful for that. You still seem to have a spark of light in you. I'm not gonna... not gonna let you go. <laughs> That's a spark of light in you! Too much already. <laughs> I like the light. What's there to like about light? It hurts to look at. That is true. It hurts to look at you. Always making this personal. And you're always trying to pretend it's not. <laughs> nice. I like those two. Those two are nice. Ooh, you gained a PSI point. Use it to unlock powers in the mutations menu. Some powers are locked by the aura score, meaning that your PSI points can only unlock powers of the same color as your current aura or those without color. Okay. There's out of date again. He must have missed something important. Hey, where out of date says you will make a better stand against the world eaters with the support of a tribe, and there are two nearby. The Myriad tribe is likely to be a good match as they act on the understanding of the greater good and have a code of honor. 
Okay. Yeah, you Mawa. Regardless of who you choose, it won't be easy, as the conflict between the tribes is worse than ever, teetering on the brink of war. Huh. The Myriad's conviction to stop the World Eaters began when the Leviathans rose from the depths of the surf. Siding with the Myriad's movement for wholeness in a fragmented world might seem like the logical thing to do, but is it the right thing? One thing certain, though. Destiny arrives all the same. Okay. The Jagni tribe only ever had one conviction, to bring balance to the world by wiping out the weak. They believe a cleansing is necessary to restore the world and want to let the world eaters bring down the tree of life. But siding with Jagni isn't necessarily a bad thing. Fate will find a way. Okay. Yatu Yao Mawa. Out of date says someone needs to break the stalemate and shift the balance of power to either mm. Jagni's or Myriad side. Already to he a believes the tribe choice. Sifus, Myriad especially, will listen to you and expect you to pay at least one of them a visit and play your part. The what? Out of date will be waiting for you beneath the tree of life if you lose track of what you need to do. Okay. Who? Agni or Myriad Shifu? Uh, I'll go with. Are you... you're Mirrod, okay. I'm gonna go with Mirrod, to be honest. Another fork in the road. It's either the tunnel or the motor bridge. What'll it be? Uh, I guess tunnel, because that's where Mirrod goes. Um, I'm, if I ever do another blessed, or another point, I'll... I'm gonna stay light. I'm gonna stay light throughout all of this. I wanna not miss anything, you know? So. It's unusual that natural tunnels like this still exist. Most of them got flooded. Ah, uh, what was it? Character? Mutations tab. Okay. Bio points. Ooh. Wait a minute, what was it? It wasn't Wung Fu. It wasn't that. It was Aura, that's what it was. Somewhat like that. Somewhat light Aura means being the best one can be and a willingness to help others in need. Uh, to use file, I'll press it down. Oh! That is, that is very vile. <laughs> To, uh, it will make you spew toxic slush in the direction you are facing, inflicting damage. All mouth, moth mouth. To use moth mouth, press the input you have bound the ability to you while facing an enemy. This will affect any small humanoid. Will affect an enemy. Ooh, you know what? Moth mouth seems pretty good. We'll go with B. Ah, okay. So that's what left trigger does. Got it. Yeah, we'll stay with light. Uh, there might be too much. There it is. Come here. What am I supposed to attack? Can I just like... Yeah, sure. <laughs> This area was beautiful before the tribe war began. Look at it now. It's a war zone. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, my cat's laying down. I'm pretty sure yes, this is for a That's nice the Myriad tribes fortress. Will they be friends or foe? You should head up there. That way you'll know. Mm-hmm. That's where I'm heading to now. Just go in the uh 
Oh, it's you can walk on. To that door. If you go there, you'd better make an entrance. Hi. Says they're wary of strangers. They're at war. Show me to this Sifu, please. Says the Sifu decides who the Sifu wants to see, but is willing to let you give it a try. Okay. I can do that. Oh, you're pink. Can I, like, become a double agent? <laughs> the myriad tribe act on understanding of the greater good and a code of honor. They believe uniting the tribes is the only way to restore the peace. Let's do that. I'm fine with that. The Sifu is convinced that defeating the world and saving the tree of life is the only way to make the world a better place. He welcomes you to the Myriad Fort and introduces himself as the tribe's Sifu. But he was hoping you'd show up. The news of a vigilante Ronin on crusade crossing the Great Wall through the crack in Bunker 101 has preceded you. Vigilante? He heard you took out of date side against the scavengers in Bunker 101. It seems you believe in helping your next, and that's something you have in common. There's something about your spirit that sparks memories of you as a kidling. He can still sense your kind hearted. The Sifu says sometimes one memory can make another come to life. He hasn't thought about your Muma for ages, even though she taught him a lot. He was one of the original Wang Fu disciples. So I'm guessing the good is Muma. While the bad is Popsy. <laughs> My Mooma? Your Mooma invented Wang Fu. Originally, it consisted of unarmed combat and the six weapons. The boomerang, the shuriken, the bow, the staff, the nanchuk, and the hook and chain. Ooh, hook and chain. Myriad wants unity between the tribes. Their goal is understanding of the greater good and establishing a code of honor. If you believe there's some good in everyone, there's still hope for tomorrow. You'll unite the tribes and defeat the World Eaters to save the Tree of Life. Ooh, okay. Ally with the Mirrored. They want to unite the tribes, defeat the World Eaters, and save the Tree of Life. Warning. Set the game's end goal to save the Tree of Life. Choosing destiny for defeating rival Sifus is limited to unite or subdue. Hmm. I'm kind of thinking with going with Myriad, to be honest, because, like, that's what I think of, like, an adventure, saving the, tr saving life type of thing, not, not ending a lot of stuff. <laughs> to save the Tree of Life, yeah, saving the Tree of Life might be good. Choosing destiny for defeated rivals, unite or subdue. Yeah, I'll join. He was hoping you'd join them. You understand that there's no harm in doing good to others. The Sifu was waiting for something to tip the balance in their favor, and with you by their side, he's confident you can unite the other tribes. The one you should coerce first is the Jagni tribe. Yep. Do you have a boomerang? Nice. Their kin have run out of options and found themselves backed into a corner. Even those who desire peace have been forced to prepare for war. He wants you to focus. These are the new rival outposts your tribe needs to take control of. Okay. Ah... <sighs> So now he says you'll regret not being on their side. The only way you'll learn their secrets, Wong Fu and the tribe weapon now, is if you defeat him. And that will never happen. You both have gentle minds, so they want to wage a gentle war. 
A war that bonds as much as it breaks. Tells you not to be afraid. Your fate cannot be taken from you. Claim the rival outposts and earn the right to wield the tribe weapon. Is it a boomerang? Once you've dealt with the rival's outposts, you'll challenge their Sifu to unite their tribe with yours and let your kin share land again. Seeing you brings back his memories of the old village. He remembers your kind and unselfish soul and can sense you still have it in you. The will to do good. Anyway, the memories you make with your family are strong and can sometimes come to life. Passing the old village on your way to the first rival outpost might help. Okay. Okay. Which makes me think, what would have happened if I took the other side? Let me back up, let me back up. <laughs> well, this will be easy. <laughs> I take no fall damage. Let's go. Can I swim now? So since I have a sword, do I just like get rubber bullets and all that stuff? rubber bullets and use the back side of my sword, the blunt side. Okay, that takes no... Okay, so it's only dodging that takes some energy. Got it. Oh, what is this? Oh, hi. Hey, you're supposed to be attacking the other dudes, not me. Ooh, there. Oh, I nearly died there. <laughs> I gotta be careful. I gotta be careful. I wasn't even paying attention. This is really intriguing. I, I get to choose a side, basically. Ooh. What are you? No, hold on. Don't get well. There we go. Childhood village. Uh, actually, hold on. So. Hmm. Okay. Uh, so I need to take yellow for now. Got it. Got it, got it, got it green they're yellow there might be more tribes too i think i'm pretty sure there's more tribes oh better beware that's a mump up ahead they were hit hard by evolution the wonky ones especially deformed and unfurled Never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. They are all gone. <laughs> I kind of know the attack banners now. Ooh. Ow. 
Ow. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it. Whew. Okay, back up, back up. Quick kill. What did that do? Oh, that's parrying. That's right. Oh. Okay. You're level three. Come on. Start from last checkpoint. <laughs> I can't even get close. <laughs> what do you want, little one? I hear you. Okay, so right beforehand. Well, at least I know that the save is here, so I can battle this as many times as need be. Yes. Yes. Okay, let's let you up. Hold on. Yep, I hear you. Come on. Come on. Yep. There you go. You're out now. Oh. Uh, if you wait a little bit, she's gonna scratch at the door again. <laughs> yeah, I'll show her. Her name's Misty Blue. <laughs> Everywhere, that's a mump up ahead. Yep. They were hit hard by evolution, the wonky ones especially, deformed and unfurred. Ooh. There we go. Tried to attack there again. Get back in there. Come on. Coffee, okay. It's an odd thing, don't you think? Oh, I can level up. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Uh, I'm probably gonna want to do strength this time. Mhm. Mm Get side points. Uh, who I can do? Nah. Yes, I points. Let's see. Blaze. Use blaze. Press down the input. Yes. Launch it forward and leave a trail of fire. Oh, that is cool. And blink. Use blink. Press down the input you have bound the ability to. It will teleport you in a direction you're moving. <gasps> I 
kind of want to use Blaze, though. Blaze sounds cool. Okay. Time is lost on this place, but mm -hmm. it evokes a tingling sensation. There's something special about it, drawing you closer. Memory time. But first, P. Let's see. Okay. I zoom out. We're still technically okay. We're not in the green anymore. We're in Uncharted. As time passes, memories fade, and sometimes feelings change. It's not about who you were. It's about who you've become. This story is far from over. Okay. Echoes of a long lost past, like whispers in the wind. Were you gonna see Elvis again? Nope. Goop. Here's someone who takes each day as it comes. Okay. He wonders where you've been. He hopes you've been out at the lake, practicing your swimming technique. Hmm, I should like to. See all of us again. <laughs> My goop is good. Yeah, goop is good. Ah, <sighs> goop backwards as Pog. Learning to swim can be scary when you don't know what you're doing, but fortunately he's here to give you a helping hand. Do I get to learn how to swim? He thinks you should really know how to swim by now. I'd be grateful. And he'll be <laughs> Are you a beaver? You're a beaver. <laughs> I'm swimming. You can swim in most waters while in very deep water. You slowly lose key energy, and when you're out of key, you're gone. Okay. Just, just throws me in there. He says that wasn't too bad, was it? You keep at it. <laughs> Way to go! Don't let the sound of the waves drown out your spirit. Okay. But you need practice. Me. Lots of practice. Judging by your Moomer's look. It seems you forgot something. You promised you'd train with her before the sun goes down. It's time to go. <laughs> we don't know how to swim. Fucking <laughs> throws me. Anyways, sorry, I just want to get that done. Uh, I've been looking forward to it. The dedication to training is important. You can't rely solely on the fact that Wang Fu is in your blood. You should know. Practice makes perfect. Yes. She'll see you at the village square. <sighs> we'll see you there soon. She'll be waiting for you. There will be a surprise for you at the end, too. <gasps> Let's go. Let's go. Surprise. Can I grab this stuff here? Who are you? Here's another familiar face. Oh, Gizmo. Oh, Gizmo. He was hoping you could help him pick up some scrap for a thing magic he's working on. If you pick it up, I don't have to. I don't mind picking up trash. He's happy to hear that from someone that's a part of the coming. Uh. You should look for things that are recyclable. It shouldn't take you too long to find some. Sorry, sorry. I'm getting sidetracked. I can finish this easily, though. Oh, okay, I have to do that. There we go. Finished. He wonders what usefulness you found. You're the expert. Sometimes he's an expert, but sometimes he just does what's right. He can work wonders with almost anything and asks if you know how to upcycle. Things you make are great. He says only a few are willing to do the little things, but if you make enough of them, they can have a big impact too. 
You okay. don't want to. He'd love to teach you to upcycle, and the scrap you found would be a good start. <gasps> Welcome to... Oh, we get to craft. Nice. Welcome to crafting. Here you can modify existing weapons and armors, and if you're feeling creative, create entirely new weapons. Or pieces you can craft your own weapon. Start crafting your weapon. First, select the base. This defines which kind of weapon you'll craft. Three different kinds of melee weapons. Crush, one-handed, slash, and two-handed slash. Continue crafting your weapon. Select the handle uh, slot. What is the handle slot? Oh, handle slot. Select the handle you want in order to be able to craft your weapon. Uh, Hmm. Kind of want to go with the banana. <laughs> that seems pretty good. That seems like, you know what? Good. Craft your weapon, press X. Wielded a banana. <laughs> Perfect. You did well, but he can't help but wonder why you decided to craft a weapon. Made something for Muma. Fruit, drink, drink, he believes being considerate will help you feel at peace with yourself. <laughs> He's looking forward to seeing what you'll make next. It seems you have a talent for this. It looks like she's starting to lose her patience. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it, I gotta go, I gotta go. You know she doesn't like waiting for you. She wants to see you on the village square right away. Sorry I'm late, I was helping Gizmo. Then you've got a good excuse. You share a responsibility to prevent hardship on nature and the environment. It's your future. Betty? She wants you to grow up and start thinking for yourself. You really need to find yourself before she's gone. Gone? She won't live forever, you know that. But she intends to make the most of every day she gets, especially the ones you share together. You've always followed your own path, but this time she needs you to follow her. You got it, my banana. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Where is it? The chatting. You wanted to see the cat. She's already at the door. Hey, you are. Come here. Oh, there she is. <laughs> Hopefully, uh, yep. <laughs> She's very small. She does not like me holding her like this, though. Okay, here you go. Ah, <sighs> she hates being held. <laughs> The grumpy complaint. Yes, definitely. Where are you? There you are. She likes to do what she wants. She does not like to be picked up or anything like that. So, or patted, but I will pat her for everything. Okay. Get back to playing. Ah. No, I they wanted to avoid. Better watch out. He asks you to stop right there and wonders where you think you're going. I'm late for training. Hats. She's right here. <laughs> the tail. That's all you see. I'm late for training. He says that it's not too late for you to turn back, though. There's no way they'll let you pass. Oh. He wants to know who you think you are. They're the guild leaders and whoever the middle one is. I don't know who it is, but those two are the guild leaders. Uh, I'd rather be a nobody than you. <laughs> You're pushing out of to be a nobody than you. Oh my god. That is brutal. No one needs to get hurt. You'll have to face pain at some point. He offers to help you get it over with. Okay, I'll attack you with my banana. Oh. Ooh. 
Whoa! I don't have my gun. Oh, I am so... Uh, I was pressing X. No. Time to go again. Oh. No, my banana! <laughs> My banana, no! My banana. She asks if you're hurt. What happened? <laughs> we should have like them up to train. They're insecure and they're envious because I have you. No, they're just in they're just insecure. If confidence is silent and insecurity is loud, she thinks you're absolutely right. <laughs> the most important thing is that you're okay. Yep, but they took my banana. Time to focus on your training now. They took my banana. I want my banana. I just want to train. I did not think that it would be something like this. To be honest, I really thought that it was going to be like uh, Rocket the Raccoon. Is someone close to heart doing what he does best? Popsy. He asks if you could help him too before you leave for training. If you tell Mumba. <laughs> He'll talk to her, sure, but you know she wants you to accept responsibility for your own actions and future. Aww. He suggests you get going and find him gadgets and ideas for how you can upcycle some old fabrics. Ah, <sighs> okay. Can I get my banana back? You okay, Mist? Your tail keeps whacking hard. Wow, this is such a huge door. <laughs> what age am I? I just now realized, why is everything so much bigger than me? I'm trapped in here too. He's curious to see what you found. Something familiar to renew. He's all for renewal and has even considered making the trip out into the wilds to look for a bionucleus pool and refresh his DNA. <laughs> he says it's about time you learned how and offers to teach you, starting with the scrap you found. Oh, so I get to, Okay, when looting you find add-ons, these can be crafted onto an item to increase the stats of the item. To upgrade armor and clothing with items. Select a slot. Okay. Twister. Divider. <gasps> Patch plate. Divider. Mm. I mean, none of this. Ooh. Twin clan. Nice. Sim? The style might be too edgy for his. Works in Donia in a month. You should take it with you. Wear it to practice. He's looking forward to seeing what you'll make next. It seems you have a talent for this. I know, right? It seems like I have a talent for everything. Now let me train. Can I get my banana back first? Oh, you are just so big compared to everyone else here. Your Muma says it's about time you got here. I'm easily distracted to work on that. Wants you to understand that you can do anything if you work really hard. Mm -hmm. She says she is eager to get started. You don't have much time left before the sun goes down. Huh. Oh. <laughs>
<laughs> well, and there goes the add-on that I just added in. Your Muma says you did well today. She's so proud of you. She did this and there was a sound effect to make it sound like they hit, but she went like this. <laughs> Muma has the force. Confirmed. <laughs> so proud of you. Uh, I did all the work. Why are you proud? I'll try harder. That's all she's ever asked of you. Kala. Been working on a present for you, with the help of Gizmo and Wiz. Ooh. You should go see him and find out what it is. You've deserved it. Is it my banana sword? Oh. <gasps> oh, it's you! Come here. <laughs> never seen an apparatus as green as this little thing. It's wonderful. Mm -hmm. A piece of scraptronics like this has built-in old world tech that makes it a potent communication device. It's called an automaton and it's hardwired to your DNA. It'll follow wherever you go and see whatever you see. Ah, okay. Will it record what happens to me? I'll be under surveillance. That's good if anything bad happens. That's good if anything bad happens. But speaking about DNA, does that mean that I can change my DNA with that pool or whatever it was? <laughs> that seems dangerous. You're lucky to have such a fine helper with you. Your Muma says you look tired. No wonder. It's been a long day. I don't want to end yet. Everything ends, both good and bad. <laughs> yeah, that is exactly how it starts. Changing DNA, grabbing DNA. Okay, never mind. What are you? You're supposed to be. <laughs> Fires right next to me, okay. Your Muma urges you to blaze a trail. A burnt kidling will learn to dread fire. Ah, hold on, wait. That is exactly how a how Jurassic Park starts too. That's just adding fuel to the flame. Oh. <laughs> Okay. Give it a last burst and you'll make it. Yep. I'm out. Let's go. Your Muma says this is it. The time has come. She must fight Lupa Lupin. This time there's no escape. She can hear him coming. Uh huh. Whatever happens, you need to know she loves you. And everything she's done has been to protect you, your Popsy, and those she was chosen to lead. Here it comes. The past coming to haunt the present. Oh my god, it is, he is so huge. Oh! Wait a minute. Eh! Eh! I'm here. Distracted. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh. We're on his back.
Okay. Your Luma says you can make it if you believe in it. Where she goes, you go. Blood is thicker than water. Oh. You're in deep surf. Don't make waves. The surf goes where it wants to go. It'll take you to the shore as long as you go with the flow. Oh, okay. So do I just follow the flow? Oh, I'm not even controlling. Okay. Oh. Uh-oh. He's under the water. Oh. Uh, <laughs> okay. I guess I died there. <laughs> okay. And it, I, I thought we were just going to swim to safety. I thought that I was at a very certain amount of, uh, things. Never mind. Oh. Oh, no. Death is not to be feared by one who has lived life with a pure heart. A part of her will live on in you. <sighs> the creature is hungry for more. Nothing is going to stand in its way now. We turn from Jurassic Park to uh, Marley and me. <laughs> if a sacrifice is made for someone else, it's not lost, but passed on to the next. Life must go on. Real sacrifice comes from love and necessity when all other options are exhausted. The ultimate test of conscience is the willingness to give up anything uh -oh. to save what you truly care about. No! What you do for yourself, why do you do? What do you do for your kin? <sighs> and it makes you immortal in their memory. And now we're back. And I'm growing. <laughs> As the moment fades and is lost, the only thing that remains is loneliness. Aww. It doesn't mean you'll forget your past. It simply means you need to move on. So that's where this all happened. Okay, you can now craft weapons. <laughs> oh my god, hold on. My mouse is freaking out for some reason. There we go. Okay, we're good. Oh! The tribe's caught a Fluffy Hulk. Better watch out, it's no pet. Fluffy Hulk. They couldn't keep it down. Fluff hulks on the loose. Oh, you are fluffy. Ooh. Let me back up. Oh, you are just charging after me. Nice. I missed the wicked, the wicked wolf. Ooh. Oof. Okay. Oh, did it just grow claws? Oh, dang, okay. Oh, 
What is it doing now? Ooh! Ready to dive back. Oh, I just used all my probably quick heals already. Oh, I thought I dodged that, okay. Ooh, there we go. Yeah, let's go. Oh. <laughs> A group of myriad crusaders already headed out to Jagni's Mercadorpus outpost and are waiting for you there. You should hurry there and help them best the outpost. Uh, is it far from here? Not really. It's west of Bricktown. You can spot Gizmo's chug yard from the hill it resides on. <laughs> chug yard! <laughs> oh, okay. Level up. Uh, let's go with... Intellect. Nice. Uh, here. Okay, your loot chance is increased. Oh. Persuading dialogue is increased by one point. Your biological mounts have five per I get mount? Biological mounts? Wait! <laughs> Biological mounts. Is that mounts from my own DNA? Use key energize. Use after a successful special attack to replenish some of your key energy. Ooh, that would be good. I'm gonna go with plating though. <sighs> okay. Can I loot this? You are very fluffy. Fluff. <laughs> An emergency box from the old days when you needed to pack a punch to survive. Wow, bet that nut makes a tight fist. Oh, clonk fist. Found the clonk fist. This powerful tool can be used to punch through walls, can even be used as a weapon. <gasps> yes, pick up. <laughs> Oh, that is cool. Hitting an enemy with a special attack fills one of your special Super Wung Fu icons to the left of your character. When all icons are filled, you can activate the Super Wung Fu state. You need to use a, spe a different special attack to fill up the next icon. Get me some health packets. Toxinol was something called a corporate juggernaut. Oh, that makes world more sense. Still bears the marks of the massive ecological catastrophes they inflicted upon the land. Uh -huh. The apocalypse they caused was the end of days for their world. But for us, it was simply a beginning. Yeah, definitely. I have a light. Oh, it is. Okay, it's my grasshopper. Nice. Okay, so lore basically. That's pretty cool. Again. Again. Nice. So. Yep. Basically, apocalypse from oil companies and dirt and all that. Tunnels like this still carry echoes from the past. Can you hear it? I see new Wong Fu. When you find a new weapon type, you'll be able to spend upgrade points and luck. Okay. Purple Palm. Goat Hammer. <laughs> Terrible Touch. 
Screaming Steel. Hidden Slam and Copper Touch. I want to see what this does. That did nothing. Oh my. Okay. Come on. Ooh. Uh, what is happening? There we go. <laughs> oh my god. Love that for us. I just now read that. I'm sorry. <laughs> Love that for us. Oh. Usually I'll get a notification, but I didn't see that notification. Okay. What do you think of this place? There we go. <laughs> I just keep burying them. There we go. Ooh. No, oh, I missed it. Just keep pressing X at this point. Whoo! Okay, yeah, you're close to done now. These guys, I think, are the hardest ones for me. Scrapalicious. Scrapalicious. Oh, interact. Oh, I got a hat. Oh, I got a hat. Oh, I got a hat. Where where do I do it? How do I do it? How do I do it? Map, gear, yes. Circle icons represent a part of the body that can be geared up. Let's grab the highlighted piece of gear. No, I, w <laughs> I want to attach it. Oh, that's so cute. Oh. <laughs> oh, I got like a little I got a little snow cap on. There's my there's my cold resistance. <laughs> oh. oh okay, nice. Yeah, well, I wonder what that is, because I was highlighting before I even got here. Oh, a trial. That notice board, filled with the leftovers of used to be once. You're getting close to one of those old Toxanol brick towns. Pay attention. Okay. The Toxanol Corporation made this place, and then just threw it away when they were done with it. They threw away whole cities? Well, small ones. Places like this were cheap back in those days, and there was plenty of space get done with one place you just build another okay there must be a track somewhere in this brick town just hope it's not buried okay yeah sure why not let's do this uh place waypoint It's Side beyond coast. late. Yeah, I want to do the Bricktown one. How do I do the Bricktown one? <laughs> oh, excuse me. Loot old world gadget. Okay. So are we just looking through here now?
Hmm. Momo. Momo. Is that a cat? I think that is supposed to be a cat. Okay. It just did something weird. <gasps> P. <laughs> yes. Oh, that is not a good color P. That's like a... Oh, that is a toxic P. <laughs> I saw something in here. I thought I'd see a clothes soaker from the long gone again. It's an up cleaner of unwash. The clean... You need to get the pegs lined up to get the clothes soaker rolling. What pegs? I'm so confused. Oh. Just right. a few moves left. Make them count. There we go. Uh, those are gonna get harder soon. You really put a spin on it. Ooh, you know what? I'm picking that up. Hold on. That might be better than this. Wait, I have something on my right shoulder. Okay. I can root pants. Future you can use that. Oh, I need five. Okay, okay. I get it, I get it, I get it. Nice. Okay, where to next? Wait a minute. Old world gadgets. Okay, so I can... S okay, so it doesn't tell you exactly what you need. It just says that this might be here. Nice. Nice. Health packet in. Merp. Health packet. Nice. Ooh, this is starting to get interesting now. I mean, it already has, but still... <laughs> I'm starting to like this a lot more. Hmm. Just wish there was a way to like zoom out a little bit because I feel like I'm a little bit too close. Ooh. Spark plug. <laughs> Actually. That fits a little bit better. Yeah, that fits a little bit better. Okay. Is there anything else now? Everything seems to take longer at night. The moon is moving. Okay, so it does have an actual day-night sensor. I thought that it was just like, oh yeah, no, and since you just exited out of here. Curbs, nice. Through here, what's this? Popped up. Nice. What's this? I'm just like exploring now. Something for your trouble. Another hat. I don't know if there's a limit to how much I can hold either. I hope not. I want to be able to hold everything. <laughs> no, you know what? That's a lot better. <laughs> so we got a sea little. Oh, I can't have the bucket head. I need to be level 5. Actually, that works for now. I like that. I can't have the bucket head on. Open this up. Have to check everywhere. Electric plug. Nice. Oh, that. Collar jumper. Ooh. 
I didn't think that that was going to be something that I could look through, but that's perfectly fine. <gasps> Backpack! Nice. I get more armor now. Okay, fine. I'm actually... I'm, this game... Dark out there. Yeah, 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 it is. <laughs> I'm loving this now. I wish I played this sooner. Huh. I'm just gonna be like rolling around at the speed of sound. <laughs> Trying to find some stuff. <laughs> they head up there. But first, I see something that interests me. An interactable. How do I get in there? Where was it? Ooh, basement. I knew I saw something here. Flat knock. <laughs> I just love the names that they give everything. A flush stool from the back in time. It's an apparatus that sink sunks yellow juice and brown bobs. Let's try out the brush away. See if you can off chase some drip droppings. Yellow juice and brown bobs, yep. Seems like Perfect. the tighteners on the piping need to be unturned correctly to drain the flush stool. Rotate this way. Yep, okay, and then this one wanted to go this way. There we go. Sorry, that got very confusing for me. I'm just like, it, it's That's rotating. the kind of trouble you really want to wash away. Remedy. Kills with this weapon heals for double the damage. Ooh. That's pretty. And a hat. A teddy beanie. <laughs> nice. Yeah, because, like, some of this stuff is pretty good. Or, uh, it's very confusing. Because you can only rotate, so. I need to figure out if it's going counterclockwise or clockwise or something like that. Is where I came out of? The forest has so many kinds yes. of trees. Yes, yes it is. Oh, that a frog. Hypnotic <laughs> mask. Oh, I still need to be level five, but oh wow. Pretty sure I have to go through the buildings. Okay, so there's something up here. Which is this the place I entered before? No, it is not. Ooh. Cold and nice. That is always gonna be candy. Oh, I thought it would have been here, to be honest. There. He wastes crap, nice. Just looting everything. That's that's all it is now. Bamboo hat. <laughs> is this it? Clencher. At least they give, like, a lot of health packets, too. Oh, cut out. That was the superb alert. Okay, loot. You found the track. Amazing it wasn't destroyed. Just died. So <laughs> I don't know. This was just discarded. Lucky the track somehow made it. Uh, 
How did, wait, how'd you die eight times? Was it just like creepers or zombies or something like that? Was this ever nice? No, why leave? When Toxin all abandoned the place, it fell apart fast. Not too many like living in a ruin hole like this. True. The tracks moved on from Bricktown, and you should too. Mod mobs. The first one was when the others were all from those mobs. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's once once one happens, it's just like a a continuous cycle. Squint into the oncoming light. I'm just like just trying to get your stuff back. It's a never-ending cycle until it finally ends. Hmm. Oh. There we go. Hopefully you got your stuff back. Your your items. Fire thing too. Pretty cool. Oh, okay. You don't have anything too crazy. Hopefully, it was just like blocks or like a stone sword or something like that. Yeah, because when you when you have your awesome stuff and then it just gets lost, that's the worst part. Okay, so I need to go there. Oh, I'm heading anyway to this. Okay. Hey, Oddity, how you doing? <laughs> oh, thank you for the raid, Oddity. Had some decent stuff like cool mod trees, but I did have a diamond sword found, so kind of sad about that. Oh. <laughs> Not the diamond sword. Hosts from those that used to work at the chug yard back in the days gone. They don't make much sense these days. Not much more to say about the board. But Gizmo is holed up in the underyard here working on that necron of his. Oh. The Toxanol Corporation used to run chugger chuggers out of here. Big machines on rails with smokestacks that fouled the air. <laughs> I'm just gonna call trains that from now on. Chugga chuggas. <laughs> uh, oh wait, yeah, cool mod trees are always good. Uh, where did the rails go? They can carry you anywhere you like. Well, anywhere that they go to, and then you can leg it from there. <laughs> You're on the right track. Keep your eyes open. I hear something that I'm scared of. I hear thumps. Hop off for the night. Yeah. Good night, Geta. Have a good night. Um, yeah. Have a good night. <laughs> oh. I'm just trying to figure out where to go and what to do. Oh. There we go. Tribes always scavenging for scrap. And the yard had plenty to go around, but they should have stuck instead of playing around with sprockets. Bomber Bonkers busy ram banging the door. This is your chance. Ooh. Okay, 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 okay. What is that doing? Ah! We're gonna go with the sword again. 
I like the sword. Who are you? Oh, I was supposed to shoot you. Nice. There we go. Oh, and you level up, you... Oh, okay, nice. Oh! bit of shots right there oh you're here <laughs> whoa Missing all of my shots here. Ah. Uh. <laughs> No, I didn't. No, I did not mean to go there. Take out the small one first. Okay, now on to you. Ow. Nice. Okay. Oh, fuck. I just got hit. Oh, okay. 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 I'll finish this and end it. <laughs> oh. Okay. Come on. Tribes always scavenging for scrap, and the yard has plenty to go around. But they should have stopped the looting instead of playing around with sprockets. Ooh. You might want to fall. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, no, 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 no. Oh my god, okay. For bonkers busy ram banging the door. This is your chance. Hold on. Uh you know what? Just kill me. I use too many health packs, just get get it done. 
know what? I'm going after you now. Come here. Ooh. There you go. <laughs> Restart. Okay. Let's do this. Ooh. That was a good pop. Ah. Okay. Let's do this again. Tribes always scavenging for scrap, and the yard has plenty to go around. But they should have stopped the looting instead of playing around with structure. Oh my god, he's already dead. <laughs> I want to use the health pack. Oh my god, that is a lot of bullets. Right in the face. Vigilante! Ow. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. I've learned it now. gets pushed. Okay, now on to you. you have a good eye. Nice. Oh. Oh, last time. Last time. <laughs> last time. Hey, Belinda, how you doing? I see the meat boy. <laughs> that's, that's how I'm feeling right now. That's how my character feels right now. <laughs> After dying four times, chain her to the big blade. Let's do this. Tribes always scavenging for scrap, and the yard has plenty to go around. But they should have stuck to the I'm doing good. Oh, oh. I just fat I bought this game a while, I decided to play it, and this is now going good. This box once tailed a <laughs> Now it's just off track. Send him up in the air and then pop. Like how you have cat as one. <laughs> yeah, now I do. Speaking of which, I'm I'm gonna pause in the middle <laughs> combat. But speaking of which, uh, hold on. Uh, hey man. Yes, you are. She's good.
I got you. Up. I love you. Yep. Okay. Back in your bed. Bye -bye. Sorry for disrupting your sleep. You weren't even sleeping. It's fun. <laughs> <sighs> I call her the uh, mischievous meowster because literally she uh, will wake me up by clawing my face like this. That's it. Okay. Time to get back. Ooh! Yeah, no, she is. <laughs> She does what she wants. Ooh. gonna come back over here for now. Oh, hi. Uh, small health. Oh! Ready to take on the world. Okay. Uh, yeah, she, she just... Ooh. How's Fallout going, by the way? Belinda. Ah, he's... Okay. Ooh. I'm taking damage. <laughs> there. <laughs> Fallout. <laughs> Didn't I say that? I could have sworn I said that. I'm so confused now. I don't even know what I said. I will do this though. <laughs> Tribes always scavenging for scrap, and the yard has plenty Paula. of <laughs> But they should have stuck to looting instead of playing around with sprocket. There. <laughs> no, it's fine. I'm sorry. I don't know. All is good. Nice. There is a lot here. Oh my god. <laughs> you haven't been playing though? Okay. Ooh. Because, actually, I think... This is both, actually, both Fallout. Okay. Both Fallout and this are uh, apocalyptic type things. There. Some more. <laughs> There's some more. I love this. Be my minions, yes! Be my minions again, please. Thank you. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> they 
just get fucking launched everywhere too. Oh, that scared me. And wait for it, and boop. Come here. Hold on. There we go. Go. Destroy him. Oh. to hit me. There. I feel like my computer is... No, my controller. Ooh. Okay, now it's just you. You and me, but we're almost done. Ooh, there we go. Oh, finally, after six deaths. Come here. Dainty. Is this what I need? No. I mean, it's one of the things that I needed, but... There we go. Don't flinch away from this. It's your moment. Oh. You need to focus. Come on. There we go. Nice. You're still alive? You are. <laughs> Never mind. Not anymore. Okay, I did. Okay. You can do anything. The sky's the limit. Now, let's take this back to Earth. Oh. Wow, you really took that all the way down to the end in flames. I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet, to be honest. Why are you so big? You're not there. Oh? Found a bio-contaminated container. Collect the bio blobs and use them to unlock mutations in the menus. Okay. Gross. This place stinks. Ew. Well, I'll be on my way now. Uh, I don't think he, I need to be here yet, so... 
Ah, <sighs> luck. Hey, Oddity, how you doing? <laughs> Uh, Charisma, Agility. I'm gonna go with Vitality. Feels good. Ah. Oh. It's already 12.40, wow. Yeah, I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet. That says main quest, and the first main quest I have is all the way over here. So. Uh, but I'm going to leave it there for now. There we go. Uh, I'm going to leave it there for now. So, two hours and five minutes, that's, that's, a, that's a good time. <laughs> um... Thank you, Belinda. Thank you, Oddity, for the raid. Thank you, Belinda and Geta, for just relaxing and hanging out with me. <laughs> uh, but on that, uh, since I have nothing else to say, thank you for watching, and I will see you later. Bye!